Welcome to the fifth and final lesson in SharkCloud onboarding. In this lesson, we'll cover how to create and interpret connections between items and categories in your story with the use of SharkCloud relationships and the SharkCloud golden thread. Adding relationships to your data adds another dimension and level of knowledge to your story. Relationships are a unique benefit of the SharpCloud model because they draw connections between items of the same category or items within different categories, which is traditionally really difficult, if not impossible, to manage and visualize in classic business solutions. Relationships can be created on most views within SharpCloud. To begin, make sure that your view is set up correctly by turning on Relationships, then going to the View Setup, clicking Relationships, and checking on the Create Edit option. You can turn on relationships in this panel as well. Now you'll be able to see all of the relationships present in your view and create new ones by clicking and dragging from one item to another. Just like items, relationships exist in the data view. Every time you create a new relationship, this is reflected in your view's data view, further proving that relationships are living, breathing data points within your story. And just like items, Relationships are also available in your story's comprehensive data grid. Hover over an item to see all of the items related to it. Focus more intently on the related items by selecting this icon on the menu toolbar. Then select the dimension in which you would like to view your item. Those that are one, two, or three levels removed, an up-down view, or as a shark cloud golden thread. Golden threads are a powerful feature for enhancing your planning and strategy development. With one click, understand an item's alignment with goals and objectives, uncover hidden gaps, dependencies, and obstacles. In an ever complex and connected world, sometimes we need to filter through the noise to see how items fit together, which is why you can also filter your data set by relationships. Simply apply these filters by right-clicking on the interactive filters panel add a new filter, and select Related Items by Category. Now apply these filters to narrow your focus to items related to that specification. Using relationships in this way is much faster, more visual, and more powerful than traditional pivot tables. SharpCloud allows you to visualize and filter complex data in a simple way. You can use relationships visually, use them as data points, and as filters to drill down into focused areas within the bigger picture. Any user with any permission can access relationships within a story so that everyone can gain more comprehensive insight into your data. Here's what each user can do within your story. Creator permissions allow users to develop stories to share with their team. Creators have full control and can change everything in a story, including adding views and editing the story's data and structure. Collaborator permissions provide users with a simplified interface with no story toolbar and are for exploring stories via views and filters. Collaborators can update and create items and relationships and use forms provided by creators, but cannot modify or change data structures. Read-only permissions provide the same simplified interface as collaborate permissions, but no data can be modified by those with read-only permissions, making it safe to share your story with wider audiences. Remember, our SharpCloud experts are always happy to help if you get stuck, and you can find supplemental learning resources from the question mark in the bottom of your SharpCloud story. Connect anything. Visualize everything. With SharpCloud.